Hey YouTube, Max here from Max Comp Tips, and today we're doing a tutorial actually in Adobe Premiere. And this is going to be basically how to cut all your video clips and audio sections individually so you can easily better edit them. So first we're going to find an audio uh, video clip we can use. Let's import. I'm just going to use the wildlife clip here from uh, the sample videos and drag that into our workspace. We will keep existing settings here. And I'm just going to open this up and scale it to size just so you guys can see it a little better. Uh, I'm going to turn the audio down a little just so that you guys can hear my voice a little easier than the video. But here's our video so far. We just have some horses running here. And let's say I wanted to take out the horses and just use them. And I don't want the birds and I don't want any of this other stuff either. I just want the horses. Well, first thing I'm going to do is enlarge the area that I can work in by grabbing this little bar down here and stretching it. It might be different depending on which version of Adobe Premiere you have. It might be a little bar over here you use, but there should be a bar down there where you can stretch and enlarge the workspace. So now that we have it pretty big, uh, you can see that the time up here will also change while I do that. It'll get bigger or it'll get smaller all the way down to the frames you can do uh, frame by frame. Now where we have it is, it starts right here in the very beginning of the video and it doesn't really matter where it starts. If you want to cut out the middle part, like if I just wanted this part, I can easily cut there too. But for the video, I'm just going to start at the beginning. Uh, wherever you want to start though, you can put your little cursor. Now from the beginning here, I'm going to let it drag on all the way until where I see the birds come. Now I want to go back into the horse area so that I don't get any of the birds in it and you can use the actual arrow keys down on your uh, keyboard or you can click this little button here this little thing that says step forward right right next to the play button or you can use the left and right arrow keys on your keyboard which I'm doing right now instead of clicking that uh, to move it frame by frame now as you see here we want to get it so that the birds are not in the picture so you want to go frame by frame until you see the birds and go back one so you see the horses again or whatever video you're using to make sure that that little frame does not pop up in your video <coughs> Excuse me, guys. Uh, anyways, now that you go here and you found the frame that you want, you want to click over here and click the razor tool. It's C right there, as you see in your little toolbar. Your toolbar might be over here, depending on how your layout is. But click that tool, and now you'll see this little, like, kind of razor with a slash to it. Right where your line is, your red line, you want to click it right there. And then make sure you click back on the mouse tool so that you don't cut anything else. And now you can separate these two areas and you have now your final clip, which is just your horses running or whatever you decide to do. And as you see, we have no frame of ducks that will be in the next scene. And if you want to cut the audio individually, right click it, whoops, right click the video and you can go up here and click unlink. And once you do that, now you can move the audio freely around as much as you want or the video. And as well as you can cut them. As you see, you click the razor tool and you can cut just the audio or you can cut just the video. And so now you can click those little segments and you can move around just the audio or just the video segments by themselves. All right, so this is pretty much the end of the tutorial. Thanks for watching again. Uh, I'm Max, and if you have any questions, please leave a comment below. I'd be happy to help you guys out. And stay tuned for more tutorials like this.